that's uh, two thirds of our routines were guys that hadn't competed in the game before. So you know, it's, it's uh, definitely a get some experience here for you guys. And uh, I just I'm really thrilled about what you youngsters did for this team. Uh, I think you put your fingerprints on it. Not to take anything away from the older guys, but uh, when you have two thirds of your routines at the NCAA championships being <coughs> performed by guys who hadn't been there before, it's, uh, it says a lot about what you guys uh, kind of set as a foundation for yourselves. For so the first award I get to is most improved competitor. And how do, how do we do that? You know, through training, stronger, uh, getting the routine that fits that person. You know. Confidence, self-esteem, all those things are incorporated in trying to be uh, a top-notch performer. So uh, the most improved competitor that we have for this year is Ross Camarano. <laughs> I'm a Big Ten champ, and I think of it, you know, almost every day I'm in the gym coaching. I think of it, and it's something that I'm very proud of, and I want to recognize, and we want to recognize our outstanding freshman, Zach Chase. So when we look at the award, the spirit of Go for Gymnastics, you know, we're looking at someone that, that we feel is connected with all those people in the past, and all those people that will come afterwards. And uh, again, we had a, a freshman that uh, the coaching staff decided that that exhibited that spirit, you know, not that not, not others haven't, but uh, someone that has exhibited that spirit throughout the season, and we're most appreciative that he's here, and uh, um, we call him the Colonel. A little warm. <laughs> oh, it's good, yeah. though, guys. <laughs> Jesse. <laughs> First, of all, first one is going to be Coach's Appreciation Award. And uh, I think that person who, who would be uh, achieving this award has all those qualities. He showed all those qualities this year. And I'm honored to represent this award to our freshman, Matt Frank. Inspirational award. Yeah. This person, in this, in his collegiate career, he had uh, ups and downs. He had injuries. He had frustrations, same as most of us. He had year that he knew he's he's not strong enough to make a lineup. And you know what? He didn't give up. He worked his tail off. He worked harder and proved to all of us, and most importantly to himself, that he is a big asset to this team. Uh, on behalf of our team, I want to thank that person for doing that. It's very important. And I'm proudly presenting this award to our senior, Ali Alu. And uh, I want to thank you, that person, for rebounding after the injury and making coming back so strong. And I'm uh, wishing him good luck in the future. And uh, looking forward to training him and have a lot of, lot of more good days in the gym. Uh, so the rookie of the year is Joshua Kurt. This pen that you're about to get is your partnership with the University of Minnesota. It's, it's, it's an amazing honor to get the jacket, but this dwarfs it in terms of who you are, how you're framed up as young men going into your careers. And I ask you to wear it proudly. Congratulations and welcome to the end.
vision of what he wants to do. He's already got a job lined up, and uh, as soon as he graduates, he's moving forward. So, our uh, recipient of the most conscientious gymnast, Michael Paulus. Tenacious, I looked it up in the uh, dictionary. It says, not easily dispelled or discouraged. I think that's a good description of this. Our uh, winner of the most tenacious gymnast is Michael Hill. For the year is um, the Big Tens in the NCAA. That's where that's where the championships are won and lost. And, uh, you know, it's critical to, to peak not only as a team but as an individual at those competitions. So, with no further ado, I want to bring up DJ Rep, our outstanding Yay! champion. Uh, MVPs on this team, I thought, but we came up with one at the end of the voting, and the winner this year. Mr. Ross Camerata. Yeah.